We're going to be talking to two representatives from the Development Finance Corporation, DFC. We have Anna Marin with us, who is the Relationship Officer, and uh, Veronica Alcocer, Junior Relationship Officer. Ladies, good morning. You're both looking radiant this morning. My studio smells delicious this morning, let me tell you that. <laughs> the fragrance is incredible. You know, we need to talk about the type of perfume that you ladies use. You know, you have Carlitos breathing like... Ah, his nostrils are wide open right now. Okay, good morning, Ms. Veronica, and a good morning, um, Mrs. Ms. Anna. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. Good Buenos morning. Dias. Good morning, Miss Kami, and thank you for having us this right. morning. We're back again. Yes, yes. <laughs> and I have Miss Anna. Anna have, Marin. Good morning. Good morning. Um, okay, DFC is going to be celebrating the Big 60 in the month of September but they are already promoting. We're going to be having a huge, huge party and lots and lots of giveaways and everything. You know, I'm already putting things in their mouth, but <laughs> let's hear about this big, big, big 60, what's going to happen and what are we promoting today? Okay, uh, we are excited. We are happy to be here. And of course, we are promoting the Big 60 that we'll be celebrating here in September. And we are starting off with lots of promotion. We have started with the giveaways of the student loans. Right now, our students who are, have applied for the student loan or are applying right now, uh, get the opportunity to win a laptop fully equipped okay. with their um, printer, their bag. So all the student loans, students that have applied from June to August 31st automatically get the opportunity to um, win a laptop. And you know that right now we are in the peak period of students getting back to school, whether they want to go to Sixth Farm, or whether they want to go to a university. Here in Belize or abroad, we are here promoting and giving a um, special interest rate for um, students who are from a low-income family. And of course, to any student who wish to further education, um, we are here promoting that today. And okay. of course, promoting all of our services that we are offering. Mm -hmm. at this Let's moment. talk a bit about, since we're on the student's loan, how can a student apply? for a loan and then we move on. Right. Once a student has been accepted uh, to a sixth farm, we ask them for acceptance letter, uh, their um, cost of course of how much it will cost. Uh, this uh, not only entail here, six farms here in Belize, but if they want to go to abroad, they already want to go to Chetomal, they want to go okay. to Guatemala, the Caribbean, the USC, London, we have students in London, wow. and we, we accept them, their acceptance letter, the cost of um, course, a utility bill. If they're a minor, a parent needs to sign for them. And of course, if they're an adult, they can do their loan alone. Uh, once a student wants a loan of 1,000 to 10,000, we need one co-signer. That co-signer needs to have their employment letter. They need to have a source of income. If they are self-employed, they need to have a proof that they are, um, have a self-employed. We take their income statement in office, or if they have their income statement with them, they can take it along with their interview. A uh, copy of their valid social security card or passport, and of course, a utility bill of their recent, um, their actual address where they are mm -hmm. living right now. Ten thousand is the max that you all give for no. students loan because I know studying uh -huh. in London must uh -huh. cost more than ten thousand. No. Ah uh, no, no. We ha we give more than that, no. But um, for six farm, we usually maybe maybe give them five thousand to seven thousand okay. five hundred. Um, if they're going to St. John's or Escuela Secundaria Mexico, depending on what's their budget, because when they come, they bring their little paper. Okay, tuition and fees is costing maybe six thousand, and if they're studying in, in in University of Belize, it may cost them maybe like eleven thousand, and then we give them assistance also for boarding if they want to. Um, for rental, if they want for personal expense, for food, we also give assistance for that. No, um, usually for our six farm students, the, the range comes from one thousand to seven five. Um, for university, and that is a bachelor's degree, depending on where they're studying, it's um fifteen to twenty thousand. Okay. Um, we also give assistance for students who also have scholarships because we are seeing that. Many students, may, some of them have tuition and fee scholarship, but maybe the parents cannot afford the boarding that is the rental. Then we give them assistance for that. What we requested for them to bring an estimate or maybe an actual rental agreement that we can see, okay, the rent is costing us so much. <coughs> uh, if the student is traveling outside, then we can also give them assistance for traveling that is purchasing of their 
plane ticket. That is one one way for them to go and then one way for them to come back until they have completed their studies. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, all right. And so the what of the competitive that we have within uh, the DFC and, and, and the others is that we offer grace period during the studies. Uh, the students do not have to pay nothing towards the uh, loan that is principal. They will only be paying interest during the time of their studies, the interest will be based on how much will be dispersed. Uh, what we do here at the UC is that we monitor the students. We don't give them the money in full. Uh -huh. We give them the money on a semester basis, meaning that every semester they need to bring their grade report. Once they have a GPA of two, then we give them another money. And during that will be, let's say, it will be August, September, October, November, December. Every month, we expect that the student parents or the person who is in charge in paying the interest pays the interest right. every month. Mm -hmm. And then comes December, we request the student for their grade report. And then when they bring the grade report, then we give them another disbursement. Right. That will be, we will be monitoring that. Once we see that the student is not passing, then we pass the disbursement and we uh, say, okay, what's happening? Do you really want okay. to study? Because right. after you have completed your studies, you need to pay the loan. Mm -hmm. So yes. we have to ensure that the student pass, and we have to ensure that the payments of interest is paid on a monthly right. basis. So then if that happens, then it means that you don't, if the student is not passing, mm -hmm. then that means that you don't give them the entire uh, loan that they applied for. Because if you right. apply for 10000 just to give a scenario, you apply for 10000 you know, you start disbursing that money by semester. Right. But then if you see that the student is, is failing, you take a pause and you say, okay, what's wrong? You try to talk mm -hmm. to that individual. But if he continues that way or she continues that way, then you break that, that business relationship right. with right. them. Right, we break that relationship and we ask them, okay, do you really want to study? We we put that on hold. And then we, if you continue the studies, then we can, we can always place your funds on our side. Meaning after one semester, we see that, okay, Miss Kami, um, uh, you will come as Veronica. I was maybe, I don't know, I didn't understand the first semester, you know, because sometimes they're just coming out from high school, they don't know what, because right, outside right. is the it, real it world. It happens, it uh -huh. happens. With that means that we do not cancel the loan. We just place it on hold. After that semester, we see that the student has a GPA of 2.5, 2.8, and they have bring up the, their grades, then we continue and give them the money. And if the student mm. wants to move from one institution to another, you know, they would say, okay, I didn't like this one, I'm not treated right, or mm. I don't like the way that they that they carry out their work. Can they change and then the loan continues? Yes, they can do that, but they need to inform us of writing and there will be another, we have to give them another contract. Okay. Because whenever they come to us, to, to us we give them a contract. This is for Centro Scolar. It takes a little uh, uh, transactions that we have to do within the, the office, but it can be done, but it's not advisable. Okay, mm -hmm. good. All right, let's move on. Um, Ms. Anna is very quiet there she just <laughs> she's just listening um uh -huh. uh, let's continue what else does the dfc um have to offer at this time when you all are looking towards the big 60. okay we provide we provide loans for the productive sector which we give productive sector which we give loans for um for livestock mm -hmm. um what else Livestock, we give for a crop loan, grains loan, mm -hmm. and um, machinery loans as well. Mm -hmm. We have in the sector, in the agriculture sector, we give for sugarcane loans, which are um, for the replanting of mm -hmm. loans and the ratoon maintenance and machinery as well. Mm -hmm. This is a, we're trying to promote the machinery for the um, cane farmers, especially the group leaders, okay. that um, we can, they can upgrade their machineries, purchase tractors, Purchase with implements, cane trucks, as well as um, um, the cane loaders, we give for that as well. Um, concerning the grains, we give loans for the majority of the time, it's for the Mennonite communities, which they plant acreage of, of grains. Another one we give for cattle, the cattle resilient program we're giving right now. Okay. And then. Um, that's about it. Well, I see, right, yeah. right. We, you know, especially the, the farmers that we have, um, we are seeing right now that a majority, they are moving on from the cane and they are starting to do farming. Right. They want to plant. Um, they diversify. Uh -huh, they are diversifying. So here we the FC, we are um, there um, cheering the, car, the, the farmers and give them loans, you know, if they want to purchase um, 
let me see seeds they want to purchase fertilizers okay. they mm -hmm. come once we ask them if they can maybe register as a farmer with the ministry of agriculture right. and they bring their agriculture paper that we not to certify is that them. a requirement you uh, need to register yes we, right. yes we do ask for that so that mm -hmm. they can benefit with the Right. The interest rate and sometimes they give them technical assistance mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. that would help them so the interest rate vary depending on the type of investment that the farmer wants to do if it's cattle if it's under the sugar industry you know if it's uh, um you know vegetable planting it varies the interest yes. rate varies it, it all depends it has a range we start from let's for example they were planting it's at six percent up to 9.75 mm -hmm. likewise the um the vegetable loans and that we start from it's a range from eight to nine point seven five. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. yes. And is there a monitoring process for that part uh, too? Yes, the loan <laughs> fees. The loan fees um, is very competitive. It's very low, no. And um, sometimes in very rare cases we finance that from the loan, mm -hmm. but the loan fees is very very competitive for maybe approximately one hundred and twelve dollars, mm -hmm. and depending on how much they want to borrow. All right. Mm -hmm. So the interest rate is totally different than different. if you go to any other banking institution. Because yeah. DFC, as what the ladies were mentioning to me, it's all about development. Right. You know? right. We are Correct. the only development bank here in Belize, mm -hmm. and and we are here to serve the people. We're here to to give develop your project no? mm -hmm. and and that's the that's the idea that we're bringing across and right now celebrating our 68th anniversary i am sure we will be highlighting many of the businesses that we have assisted we have um, educated a lot of people a lot of um, students who are having um first time jobs in right now uh, it's very happy for us now celebrating our 68th anniversary we'll be highlighting those as we the, the months come along okay mm -hmm. what other types of loans do you do you we offer? offer right now the uh, renewable um energy they are uh, if for example especially to the people who are living in san carlos if they want to um purchase solar panels um, for businesses, if they want to purchase solar panels, if they want to change their lights to REE, we also offer that. Uh, we also offer um, the empowered loans, the empowered loans, which um, for the people who want to start up their business, who have existing business and they want to expand their businesses as well. So if you are a business owner, if you want to open a restaurant, if you want to open a hotel, we ask you to come to DFC. We are located right behind Leeds Restaurant. It's a two-story building, white and green come in talk to us and let us know what is your project and we will be there assisting you mm -hmm. right and and we yes. also and this morning the residential loan and if you want yes to take yes mm -hmm. um, we offer also housing loans or do we serve loans the in the housing loan it's by phases as well what you need to submit is the approved building plan and the bill of quantities okay. and from there we move on with the with the disbursement phases Okay. And we ensure that the project is from start to finish, it's completely completed. When, when we talk about those loans, uh, you know, to electrify your home or your business mm -hmm. with these solar panels, are we seeing a lot of interest in this, in this, in this area? Because I hear a lot of people talking about, you know, let's mm -hmm. go solar. You know, they buy those solar lights, you know, they no longer worry about it, uh, uh, increasing electricity. So are we looking at a lot of people being interested in renewable? energy yes uh, we are seeing that right now that it is spiking up now the applications that what that we are here and um, promoting that I'm sure that right now during the hot season a lot of people their electricity spike up mm -hmm. so what we ask the business owners homeowners that you can maybe explore and uh, seeing how you can install solar panels to your home I, I I can guarantee you that you will see a difference in your um, electricity bill uh, Months ago, I changed all my lights from my house to M um, to the, the LED, LED uh -huh. and it made a difference. Uh -huh. It made a difference. Right. So, um, and they have electronics as well that um, goes along with that, that you can maybe um, use for your home. No, that you can maybe um, bring down your electricity because it is very very high. <laughs> right. <laughs> you know, I see that they are the um the solar fans coming out. Yes. I understand that they are the ACs, uh, solar ACs that are coming mm -hmm. out. They're pretty expensive, but if you look at it's it, a on the bright investment. Side, it's a lifetime investment uh -huh. because then you no longer, you will no longer be paying so much in, mm -hmm. in, in electricity. And pretty soon we're going to be hearing about uh, everything going, going yes. solar. You know? Who have benefited from this program are the people from San Carlos, um, people, the Mennonite community. 
We have businesses, big businesses that that, that are using solar, solar panels. Um, uh, we on our next visit, maybe we can bring some pictures that you can see mm -hmm. that these um, these businesses are, are are powered only by solar panels. Mm -hmm. So um, if you're at home and if you're a business owner, if you're a school, maybe a six farm or a, a primary school, maybe you want to explore in maybe getting solar panels for one building first. Come to DFC, approach us, okay, DFC, I want to start with this building first. How can you assist us? We give you assistance and we start off and there, you know, and, and show that we will guarantee that, that you will be using a lot of your cash, yes. investing elsewhere than yes. just paying <laughs> electricity, right? So um, so we invite you guys to come in, you know, to, to take advantage and, and seek how we can assist you. Uh, just know that we are not a commercial bank. We do not offer personal loans. <laughs> right. If you want to come, if you want to comprar un carro para tu uso personal, no damos okay. presta. Ahí ya me la <laughs> hace rato. Porque dije, si quieres comprar un automóvil, visita DFC. Uh -huh. uh, but to construct your home, mm -hmm. you, you, you do offer loans for, yes. for that or, or not? Yes. yes. What we do is that we request their, um, their income verification to see how much they qualify. No, um, I am sure young couples are looking for okay. for constructing or maybe just purchasing a land, right? Okay. And if you want, yes. To, uh -huh. Well, what we're trying to do in is initiate the process, and then um, you purchase a land. Maybe three years from now, you're in. You have a better income, or you can now ref, um, refinance to purchase it or be construct your house. Mm -hmm. We do that for now. Okay. Uh -huh. All right. Yes. So yes. if you maybe you have your son. Maybe he just purchase come out land. from from Six Farm and he wants to purchase a land. He's not making a lot of money, but he has seen a land, a beautiful land. Okay, I want to purchase the land, and then in the future, maybe five years or three years, four years, yeah. I want to construct my home. Then DFC already started the process for you. We give you for the land, and then you can give you for the purchasing okay. of the okay. house. Okay. All right. One of the things that we have right now, Ms. Kami, I'm not sure if the people know, is that they can visit our website where we have our starter homes, where we have very um, plans for a very competitive price, which is already approved by Central Building Authority. It costs you the maximum of $350 for you to get an approved plan. That they give you your plan with your PUC compared to what, what you will be paying outside with a private institution, it will be thousands of dollars. Okay. So right. visit our website, www.dfcbelize.org, where you can see all our certain homes. We have one bedroom, two bedroom, we have zinc house, we have lumber house, where you can purchase your plan. We, we request it for you from CBA, we get your plans to you, and then we construct your home. Okay, all right. So mm -hmm. there you have it. Any other types of loans that you that you that you offer? I think we've basically spoken about about all of them. All you need to do is go in, visit DFC, you know, and ask questions. Right. Ask questions. You know, the interest rate. Let's talk a bit about the interest rates on all loans compared to other banking institutions. How are they? Okay. Okay, the student loans we have what we do is that we have a range from 7.75 to 10%. To okay. Um, the the, the uh, productive, the sugar cane, is at 6%. That is not, it does not reduce. No, that is a 6% um, oh, fixed right. for the students, uh, for the um, reproductive sector. Uh -huh, for the uh, replanting, ratoon, um, uh, cane farmers, and the productive loans, then it varies depending mm -hmm. on their investment. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The business loans as well varies from 8, 9. We, we see the type of investment that they are doing. Um, that is where we we see um, how much the interest rate will be. Mm -hmm. um, what we rec we ask is that um, that what do you see offer is we offer technical support. We go to the, the the businesses and see that okay that is this is what you want to implement. This is what will happen. You know, and the what we offer is free of charge valuations. What do the others offer that you have to pay? DFC is free. We do not charge for any valuation when doing a construction of your home, no? So um, our interest rate is very yeah. competitive. <laughs> and, and, and we ask you that, that to visit our office if you have further questions, no? Mm -hmm. We are right there. We have an amount of, of staff, credit staff, readily available to, to assist you um, to, to answer any of your questions. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Now, uh, finally, closing up this morning, what are we preparing for the big 60? I know that the last time you were here, at, um, you know, promoting the pop-up shop that you had, mm -hmm. right? That was a huge success. 
success. Yes. And that was all about leading into the big 60s. So what else are we going to be hearing as time goes by, as we get closer to the month of September and to when you are going to be celebrating the, your 60th anniversary? Like I said, we have started right now with the giveaways of the student loans. Um, you're going to be hearing, visit, like our Facebook page. Our Facebook page is Development Finance Corporation. So you can get all the um, promotions that we're going to be having. Uh, we, like I said, right now, once you apply, you receive your, your student loan from June 1st to August 31st. Automatically, you get the opportunity to win a laptop. And that comes with a printer and a laptop bag. So um, if you have your student right now at home, and you don't know what to do, you, you're see, still seeking where to go, seek DSC. DSC is here to assist you in getting your student successfully graduated in within two years, four All years, right. six years, eight years. All right. Mm -hmm. And I'm sure that as we get closer to the month of September, more activities are going to take place at DFC. Yes. We don't. We are not allowed right now to, 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 to <laughs> disclose <laughs> everything. <laughs> everything. <laughs> but we will. We will. I'm sure, Miss Kami, you're going to... Um, we, I'll, I'll get to open know first. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna be here disclosing mm -hmm. it, no? And uh, we thank the Sperta Belize for always um, opening doors to us, no? And we have been working with you guys for years, and I'm sure you gonna, guys gonna be part of our 60th anniversary. All right, that's nice to know. <laughs> yes. uh, Miss Anna, let me get your final words for this morning. As I reiterate what Miss Veronica has said, visit our website. There is a lot of information provided regardless of which loan you want, except the consumer loans, we don't offer that. And um, the interest rate, very um, competitive. We vary to the range. And we have a lot more to offer coming to the 60th anniversary. Exactly. So visit the Development Finance Corporation. We are located right here in Orange Walk. You can't miss it. What's the address? What are the opening hours? Street, we are um, opening from 8 to 3.30 from Monday to Friday. Exactly. Mm -hmm. You can't miss that building. Right throughout the lunch break, right? <laughs> right throughout the lunch break. break. Yeah, no so break for, the, for these ladies. <laughs> we right. have enough staff there, you know, that we're going to be attending you right throughout the day. And you can give us a call as well or visit our Facebook visit our website and look out for 60th anniversary big bash <laughs> all right okay so there you have it visit dfc today for more information or visit their website if you have any other queries about getting a loan